Hey, it's Meyer. The other day, I stumbled upon this website along with another, and the other website had this game called Z-Type that I really liked, and I liked it so much that I <laughs> built a macro for cheating at it. I'll put the links to the websites in the description. I'd also like to point out that when I start recording, the uh, computer gets overloaded with all the information going through it, so normally, when I'm not recording, it uh, performs all the macros well, and this goes for Z-Type or Modern Warfare 2, whatever I'm playing. And uh, so yeah, I had to mess around with it when I was recording to get it to work, but it went through all the levels by itself. Enjoy the video. Alright, well if you want to see what was going on behind the screens, this is uh, what the macro is doing. It's just the alphabet with commonly repeated letters uh, in pairs like PP and SS and TT, RR, EE, FF. Uh, so yeah, you can see it fills up the page pretty quickly. You can start it again. And we've already...
created a large document of uh, text and text and text. Now, the actual script is right here. I'm still not pro at writing these things by a long shot, but uh, this was a pretty fun one. So it, I press escape to stop it. Escape equals a uh, break loop. I press control 1 to re-enable it. And to do it, I press control space. And that starts a loop that goes until I break it with escape. And uh, key delay is negative 1. I looked it up there on auto hotkey. A key delay of 0 still has a small delay, so key delay negative 1 is really your 0 delay. So I put it on 0 delay, or negative 1 delay. Um, then the alphabet, as I said, with EE -E repeated FF, I guess that's not really necessary, and then it sleeps for 30 milliseconds, and it repeats. If I don't do the sleep, then uh, the break loop doesn't work, it just repeats too fast for it to stop. So uh, that's pretty much it, I'll put that in the description as well.